What's going on guys, Mr. Clasher here. Welcome back to another Clash Royale video and in today's video of a strategy guide. So I'll should be showing you guys how to exactly stop the double prince combo. Now I faced a couple players in Royale already with double prince. So right here off the bat, the player's gonna start with double prince, but boom, I drop off my skeletons. And even though the player might actually have arrows, that's not really gonna affect much. So basically what you want to do is because the Dark Prince costs 4 Elixir and the Prince costs 5, you have a big Elixir advantage because once the player drops both of those, it takes at least a couple of seconds until he can actually even get enough of the arrows. Now those extra 3-4 seconds gives enough time for the Prince and the Dark Prince to actually get distracted and get destroyed by the troops. So my favorite thing to do is, there's a couple different ways. My favorite to, thing to do is drop skeletons, a knight first, then skeletons. That's just to distract because the Dark Prince does splash damage. Now as you guys can see, he actually used the arrows on me, but it didn't even do that much damage. So I stopped the Dark Prince and the Prince. Now a cheaper option to do is actually a skeletons. Uh, not the skeleton army, just regular. They only cost one elixir, but you can stop the prince pretty well with that as well. And I recommend the uh, goblins as well. So now I drop off archers. This is to distract. Now I'm going to let the prince do a little bit of damage on the left side, but it's not going to be a ton. And uh, yeah, I really recommend this deck. The mortar, um, I think it's the mortar. Um, I actually switched the hog for a uh, goblin barrel. So... I used to have the goblin barrel, um, I mean the hog instead of the goblin barrel, but honestly, anything that is cheap, like a knight, archers, and spear goblins slash regular goblins work very, very well. And the reason I actually recommend regular goblins instead of spears, because first, the regular goblins do a ton more damage, if you guys didn't know, they do a lot more damage than the spear goblins, so I really do like that. And I just kept blocking this player's uh, double prints attack because if he actually got both of those princes to one of my towers even one of the princes gets a couple hits that's a ton of hits on one of the sides so the best I, uh, the best deck i recommend is definitely skeletons archers and a knight those are my favorite troops maybe switch with skeletons instead of like archers or something but honestly it's not that hard to stop the double prince i think it's fairly easy to stop the strategy as you guys can see i defended off his attacks on and on about the prince and the double prince so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video again i would definitely recommend this deck the mortar goblin barrel uh, the wall breaker and the skeleton army deck so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe if you did enjoy it of course and that would be amazing and as always i'll see you all on my next video I seen a lot of shit I shouldn't have, but never forgot it though. Brothers on the corner selling crack like it was not a though. Walk inside my kitchen, baking soda all up on the floor. Police banging on the dough while gripping the 44. I was just a youngin', but this type of shit I seen before. Y'all see a white boy, but my daddy a Negro. Half breed motherfucker grip the mic and heat flow. I just wanna spread love, they want me to bleed slow. I just wanna keep the peace and help people. Give some of this money that I'm making to the people.